guys, it's Alicia and welcome back to my channel. So July has come and gone and now it is August, which is crazy. I feel like every time I sit down in front of the camera, it is another month. It's ridiculous. So today I'm going to be talking about what I'm going to be reading in the month of August. So I'm actually kind of excited because August is a little bit of a slower month for me. Um, I only have a couple books that I actually have to review, and then I have an entire month to just read what I want. I so the first book, and that is Caught by Surprise by Jen Tirana. This is book three in her Apart from the Crowd series, and we're finally wrapping up The Wallflowers. And it's bittersweet to see it end, but I'm very, very excited to see who Temperance ends up with, and just... To see these girls get their happily ever after. I'm so, so, so excited. So I'm super excited to read this one. The next book is A Rumored Fortune by Joanna Davidson Palatano, I believe is how you say her last name. And I have Lady Jane Disappears. I think that's what it's called. Please forgive me if I'm wrong. I don't have it on me at the moment, so I can't tell you for sure. I haven't read it yet, but they aren't. A series I don't believe I just think that they're two standalone books but I'll double check beforehand but this book looks so 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 good and I'm very very excited to read it and it is a gorgeous gorgeous cover and then this book I was not able to read and review in July but it is one that I'm going to try to get done in August and Finally, that is The More and the Maiden by Hannah Joy Wilkinson. Of course, if I get that book from my author friend, I will be reading that book this month as well. But if I don't, it'll be in September. But the only other book on my TBR that I really, really, really would like to get to this month is one that I don't have to review, but I probably will. And that is Fox by Nadine Brandis. I just got this. You saw it in my haul, and I'm super, super excited to read it. I've heard nothing but amazing things about it. And, yeah, I really want to get to it this month. And it's going to be because each month I'm trying to read a book that I don't have to review and it's just on my shelf so that I could start, you know, getting some books out that aren't just review. And I'm very excited to read this one. Also, I'm going to be trying to pick up Sons of Blackbird Mountain by Joanna Bischoff. Uh, it is the August book of the month for the book club that I'm a part of. And, fingers crossed, I can get my hands on it. I'm very excited to read that one because I've heard that it is pretty spectacular so we'll see how that goes so at the moment I really only have four books on my TBR so I think I can get them done in the month of August and I'm very very excited to see where each of these authors takes me on these wonderful wonderful journeys of course I'll be reviewing quite a few of these on my blog which is for the love of Christian fiction blogspot.com and you'll also see pictures of these books on my Instagram, which is for the love of Christian fiction. All my other links are in the description box below, and I think that's it. I'll see you guys next week. Bye!